Hey travelers, from this video, we will be walking through you guys, the city of Gdansk. From Bedgosh to Gdansk, it took us two and a half hours from our van to arrive to this city. The moment that you arrived to the Gdansk city, you can hear the sound of seagulls from a distance. And we always wanted to explore around like the port area. Since it was like later the day then we arrived to the city, we wanted to actually park our van and settle down in a camping site. This is our campsite and you can see a lot of RVs next to us parked and yeah, this is our van and there's three RVs next to it and you literally can live off grid life here guys. It's amazing to see the potential of uh, people who are like living life differently and about the washrooms this is the washrooms that i mentioned before over there in the corner there's a garbage dump and two washrooms no one is cleaning that for the last one month i guess so it's super smeary and it's quite uh not that good <laughs> so yeah let's go It was an amazing experience to see bigger ships coming in and out from the port. If you are definitely visiting Gdansk, try to visit the Gdansk port area because you can see a lot of cool things. So we were cooking breakfast and preparing some appetizers before heading towards to the next part of our journey. This is Plaza Pshimoje and it's beautiful beach right next to Gdansk port and we wanted to explore around the beautiful beach of north side of Poland. This is the first time that I came to Baltic Sea and the water is pretty much cold and an interesting fact is that I see a lot of Polish people come to the beach with little tents and marking their border and it's something interesting to see so uh, it, the water is not like that uh, much uh, how do you call it hot just like Sri Lanka it's super cold but once you get in it's it's okay uh, so yeah now people started coming it's like super uh, cold for me because I took the cold shower and uh, once you are in the water it's okay it's like a neutral temperature so took the shower and we went to swimming pool because uh, there was no uh, place to take shower in the dance beach this was Manya's idea and look at my hair after the shower, we decided to have breakfast next to the beach and Monya recommended to go ahead with Norwegian style breakfast. The dish actually comes with a fish paste and a good salad with two slices of bread and it's like a good nutritious breakfast and it was very fulfilling. Later the day, we decided to go to Starufka, which means like the old town of Gdansk. And we saw a lot of multicultural cuisines, restaurants in this area. And also as an attraction, we saw a pirate ship. Obviously, you can go in a tour if you come in the morning time. And this is the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching and hopefully we will be making another video journey towards to Reva.